Hello everybody, I'm back, and welcome to a very special landmark episode number 25 of Almost Daily Haiku. In the past week, I learned a very important lesson about myself, and that is, I'm not willing to sacrifice my professional integrity just for the almighty dollar. So, needless to say, I'm back down to having one job again, and uh, here I am. Today's haiku will be about the downfall of the modern corporate kitchen and how they place image over top of food safety and quality. I've worked in a few places like this in my time, and I believe that going that route can only lead to very, very bad things, such as sickness, deterioration of your business, and eventual total business failure. The one thing that I do find ironic, though, is how working at this establishment, they told me that it's a kind of place where you would never feel like you didn't want to come to work. You'd always want to come in, be happy, be smiling, because everyone around you is so great. Oh, hold on. Sorry about that. I should really learn to turn off my phone when I'm shooting these videos. Anyhow, as I was saying, that was the last way I felt when I came into this place. Honestly, after my second day, I didn't want to go back. I didn't want to be anywhere near there. It scared me. It was a nightmare. So, therefore, I'm outro. Alright, I turned the phone off. So anyhow, let's get on with the haiku about corporate kitchens and the nightmare and the downfall of what will become of the modern industrial kitchen and food service as we know it if this doesn't change. Let's make fresh, tasty, simple food. There's no need for any of this corporate madness and spoon feeding poison, basically, to people. So let's not do that. On with the haiku. No one washed their hands. The kitchen was dark as night. Someone will get sick. All I can say is, it's good to be back. And I am still looking for another job, but for the meantime, I'm gonna just shoot a bunch of haikus, have a lot of fun, and forget it, man. Because it's definitely not worth it to sacrifice your integrity for the almighty dollar. You know what? Do what's right, and do what's best for you. Don't sacrifice yourself to do, you know, make that money. You know, do it, do what's right in your heart. All right, guys, see you later. Quick side note, my phone broke again. This is the new loaner phone. Pretty snazzy, I know. It's better than the last model, Geordi LaForge. Uh, I'm gonna dub this one uh, Data. So, I've had the Geordi, this is the Data. Let's see what we get next when my phone breaks again, because I'm sure it will, because uh, it's a Motorola. Good job, Motorola, by the way, on making awesome, Frickin' phones, you guys rule. Thanks. Thanks a lot. And here's a quick shot of Christina getting ready for work. Look at me in my uniform. That was so awesome. Yeah, was it?